hello friends in today's video i'm going to show you how to uh, set up uh, passwordless authentication between the servers so there are times uh, you will have uh, so many linux servers and you will have to interact uh, with each server uh, on, on a timely basis so for each and every time you have to log in with the password so instead of logging with the password you can set uh, passwordless authentication between the servers so that you can just uh, create a trust between the two servers and, uh, and you can uh, make the files transfer very fast between the servers without even logging without even providing the password to the server so for example uh, in my case uh, i have uh, one client machine i am going to access server machine so normally we will log in uh, we will access the server machine using ssh key that is ssh uh, this is my 143 14, is my uh, ser server ip address okay let me show you uh, what is the current IP address for my client machine? So one four two is my uh, current client machine IP address. I am going to access uh, server IP that is one four three. So whenever you want to access other server, you have to use SSH. After SSH, you have to give the root or the red destination IP address. Then it will ask you for the root user password. So after you give the password for the root, it will take you to the destination server. So that is a uh, server machine. Then client machine, you have access to server machine using root credentials by providing the password. So this way uh, you will access the servers. But there are uh, times you will have to do this activity uh, on so many times. So instead of uh, providing password, uh, you can just uh, do a passwordless authentication between these two servers. So after our activity completes, uh, when you try with SSH root at the rate IP address, it will directly take you to this server IP server machine instead of asking you for the password. So uh, we are going to do this activity uh, on four steps. Uh, let me just uh, show you the four steps first step we need to create rsi key so this is a, a command let me exit first from destination server okay so currently we are in client machine uh, we need to uh, create rsi key here so it will create rsi key just enter 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 if you don't want to put any additional security you can just put enter so first step is completed so key then uh, key has been generated and second step so in second step uh, we are going to uh, create a uh, directory create a directory uh, that is dot ssh in our destination server So here my destination server IP address is 143 this one. So I am creating a .ssh folder in my destination server for root user. It is asking for the uh, destination server root user password. Okay, so second step we have completed. We just created dot ssh folder in the destination server. Next third step, we need to uh, copy the uh, key file that we have generated in step one into our uh, destination server. So just execute this command. So uh, this is this is a folder we have created in the destination uh, server, and this is a key we are going to copy. Okay. 
one four three is our destination server. Again, it is asking for the password. Okay, three steps we have completed. Now, uh, fourth step, we need to set the permissions uh, in our destination server for the keys that we have uh, copied. Okay, now we are set. We have completed all four steps. Uh, now let's see. Uh, I will connect to uh, destination server. Using root I use it. Okay, see now it is not asking any password directly it is taking to the destination server so earlier uh, in our uh, initial uh, initial step when we try with ssh and uh, root user destination server ip address it it asked for the password in the next step whereas after uh, doing the passwordless authentication uh, setting it is not asking so in this way uh, you no need to provide any passwords uh, whenever you interact with other servers frequently thank you for watching my video guys see you next video bye